Valentine's Day is a Hallmark holiday. It's one of the days where it feels like we have to one-up one another in order to provide something special for our partner. Whether it's jewelry or dinner or flowers, our consumerism culture tells us we have to do something in order to show our love. Well, this often leaves people feeling like they can't do enough, and if they don't get enough, that they aren't enough. It also leaves those that don't have partners feeling like they're not valued. And really, that's not what we want anyone to feel like. So at Fairview Community Church, about the same time the rest of the world is celebrating Valentine's Day, we're celebrating Love Sunday. Now in so many ways, it's reflective of Valentine's Day and the opportunity to show love for the people that we care about. But it goes a little bit deeper in that this is a reaction to America's love with consumerism and stuff and the way that we show our love for one another. And we talk about God's love and how God's love is manifested. Yes, it is manifested in partnership between a man and a woman or a woman and a woman and a man and a man. But it's also about love between families and a parent and a child or love of friendship. God's love is manifested in so many different ways. We see God's love throughout all of scripture as we experience God in love with humanity. After all, that's the story of Jesus, isn't it? That God loves us so much that God became a part of humanity and shared our story, sharing our love. And so on Love Sunday here at Fairview Community Church, we celebrate all the ways that God's love is embodied. And we do that in a really fun way. We love to experience music here, and so we'll have all of the talent of our Fairview family and a couple of guests as well sharing about love and those many different ways that we experience God's love in our lives. So that if Valentine's Day doesn't quite add up for us, we can participate in something bigger. God's love, which always adds up. We'll see you here on February 10th at Fairview Community Church.